to be a theme all night for you fans to watch. Now, it, it, it's a little bit of nuances when you talk about rebounding, and CJ lets one up, and look at Gabriel there again, just trying to fight for it. It doesn't matter about out-rebounding your team. If you don't do that with points, AD just got an easy put back on the other end. Here's CJ McCollum, had it blocked. McGee got a piece of that. Now the Lakers on the move. Standing that paint already, earning his time on the floor. And what do you get? A quick shot, or actually a quick early offense. And if you're Portland, you're third in the league in shot attempts. You don't have the crowd getting on you. If two guys make a shot, you don't assume them to make the next one. So I think the referee and the officiating has been great. By the way, that was a double foul, so that's a third on White. And late, it's not going to do anything but give him an extra free throw. He's still going to make the bucket. I tell you, that spin at his size has some violence to it as McCollum is fouled. To do that, so what happened on that play? Portland build a wall, just like you have to do for Anthony Kubo. Except, wow, LeBron's such a willing passer. C.J. McCollum gets an 11-1 Laker run up ahead. Which is off to a great start. Four or five from the line. He's got 11 points, 10 rebounds. By the way, LeBron halfway to a triple-double right now. 10 points, five rebounds. First quarter lead. Lakers got within two. Now within five with the ball. They deep with deep position. When the cutter goes through, you have to keep the offensive player in your vision. AD set up Caruso, can't hit the three. The Lakers are dismal from behind the arc right now. Just two makes, 12 attempts from three-point range. McCollum, two-man game with Nurkic. No, in and out, and Howard going to be called for a physical series, even though it may not look like Portland is a physical team because of their guard duo, but the bigs are going to work in the paint. Kuzma needed that, his first main basket in his first playoff game. Kuzma. Here come the Laven game winning streak. Go back to the 1977 West Finals. The Blazers won. Dr. Jack Ramsey leading the Blazers to the NBA title that year. There's a turnover by the Lakers coming out with a timeout. And Contavious Caldwell Pope gets it right back. Pokes it away from McCullum. Caldwell Pope staying in the play. That's what you love. Players not giving up. Not putting their head down and jogging back, but in a full dead sprint. Third steal for the Lakers. AD taking on the rookie and a foul. Anthony Davis with 21. Portland may have to switch up and go back to that zone a little bit. Not left. The offense of the Lakers know what's coming. McCullough, he's been quiet, but knocks that one down. Needed that. CJ McCunn point lead as we open up play in the third. The eight seed, the Blazers. So starting five on the floor. They'd like to get C.J. McCollum going, and that's a good sign early. And a good defensive stand for Portland. They lead by four. Second possession for the Blazers of this second half. Damian Lillard with 23 points in the first half. McCollum. Gabriel with a rebound. Lillard to kind of zone up. In the corner, Contavious Caldwell Pope comes up short. McCollum bounces it off his foot right into the hands of KCP. Turnover, unforced error for the Blazers. Got a report coming away from Jared Greenberg in just a moment. He had a chance to check in with Frank Vogel. Frank Vogel coaching in the playoffs for the first time since 2016. Had a good run with Indiana. Five out of six years. Took the Pacers to the playoffs. Shifty dribbling by C.J. McCollum and it rattles home. Dribbled himself free. In Milwaukee, these two coaches have a lot of respect for each other. Frank Vogel says he looks up to Terry Stotts. A great deal. McCullum trying to get his going in the second half. That was so difficult. And did you see how he kept the defender on his back so you couldn't get around? And he let them kind of zone him up, waiting for his offense to get over. McCullum, little runner in the lane. Nicely done. Went to his left hand and then really matter. And we all know what CJ can do. And right now, laboring out there, but giving his all, getting the easy one aside. Anthony Davis misses the mid-range. Six-point game. Portland in the lead. Lakers have only led briefly in this game in the second quarter. Nurkic backs Davis in. Nurkic going to work to spin. He's got a lot in the tool shed. Can't get that one to go. White side and count the basket. A goal. And you feel like LeBron is setting the table for himself too, potentially in the fourth quarter. Yes. When he starts to take over in the points category. It's a three-point game. Portland with the lead. McCullum. He's been aggressive in this. Uh, lost the handle. And now got to go. Nine seconds on the shot clock. Damian Lillard looking for someone. Finds McCollum. Pow! Buries a three. C.J. McCollum. Three as well in the playoffs among the greats. Two on the shot clock. Got to get it up. C.J. McCollum fires. Back iron. White side. Wrestling with Damian. As in developmental player development. Uh, no disrespect to any coaching staff. But when you walk in the locker room of the Lakers, I, I just suppose that you have to be in 
Oh, for the coaching staff. Is, you see White Sox. Yeah, sorry, he, he can't be here. He's very much in communication with the players that are here. There's a foul. See Jal Kuzma. That's his first made three. Ten points for Kuzma. Another assist for LeBron. CJ comes up short. James on the move. Bigman getting it right. Take two points off the board for Portland instead of a potential three-point lead. We are tied. Kuzma cannot put the Lakers on top. 78-78. Basketball sense. The ability to get Collins back after shoulder surgery. To get Nurkic back after that gruesome leg injury last March. LeBron on the run out. And the Lakers have the lead. So of this game, at one point, had a 16-point lead in the second quarter early. McCollum can't shake Caruso. Fires it anyway. In traffic, he buries a three. Right at 87. Davis on the take. Gabriel's on him. Davis, no! McCollum with a rebound. Whiteside on the deck behind. Gabriel has to keep running. Whiteside just now getting into the picture. Danny Green on McCollum. McCollum got it. Boy, Lillard and McCollum coming alive here in this fourth quarter. Portland should communicate, let him know he's being denied again. It's nothing like a layup to just frustrate a defense that's already down. Portland now with four players with five fouls, and including Hassan Whiteside. Remember, they were down six points. They've come roaring back. Two-point lead now. Four and a half to go. C.J. McCollum can't get it to go. LeBron just clears out Whiteside. Kuzma with the rebound. LeBron running the point. LeBron puts it up. He is fouled. But Davis has his man inside, so it clogs the lane, but so impressed with the defense. Danny Green lays it up and in. What a costly error right there. What a Danny pick. Green, 89. Three and a half to go in the fourth. What a game we've got tonight to close it out. No good. Another one and done. Davis secures the ball.